Hey, hub lovers. <sighs> I've been struggling with this topic because it really hits close to home. It's got me thinking hard about what I'm willing to give up for my health. <sighs> so, <laughs> today let's dive into the world of formaldehydes and parabens. Stay tuned. So, formaldehyde is a colorless, strong smelling gas used in the production of building materials and household products. It's used as a preservative in some consumer products and as a disinfectant as well. It's present in our nail polishes, hair smoothing products. Those are relaxers. Um, I relax my hair so what? Just I've been researching about this, reading about it, and I'm shocked. And um, we need to we need to stay informed about the product, the ingredients in our products. Yeah. So it's a colorless, strong smelling gas, and it's highly toxic and it's flammable at at room temperature. It's used in fertilizers, paper making, plywood, resins. Food preservative, we consume it, guys. Antiseptics, medicines, and cosmetics. <laughs> Again, Apple. <laughs> what? We need organic. We need we need products that are just safe to use. Anyway, so it has. They cause a lot of issues in the body, like respiratory irritation. Um, it irritates the nose, eyes, throat, and it can even trigger an asthma attack in sensitive individuals. It's known as a human carcinogen, meaning, guys, uh, prolonged exposure to high levels of formaldehyde has been associated with an increased risk of cancer, particularly leukemia. And then it can also make your skin sensitive and cause allergic reactions and when it's used in building materials and household products it contributes to poor indoor air quality so you can get headaches you can get dizzy you can get respiratory issues so anyway you need to check your products see if they have any of the of these ingredients listed on them and then you know <clears throat> Sit back and, and now decide. We need to just um, be more careful, more aware of what we are eating, what we are using. Yes. So let me know in the comments section what you feel about this topic. <laughs> For me, um, yeah. A lot of reflection needs to be done. I need to really know what I'm going to do because I've been exposing myself for a long time. I've been using cosmetics. I've been using most of the products that have this formaldehyde, not aware of it. So now things have to change. Let me know in the comment section how you feel about this. And share with your friends, share with whoever you're watching with. Let's learn together. <laughs>